This is the New Zealand Yen on the 15 and I'm currently short a low and tight flag. Let's just do the high time frame analysis before we take a look at this. Uh, very bearish here in the New Zealand Yen. I am looking at the market coming lower. If you look at what we've done, this, this is the most recent low and we've been working our way lower down to this level. So I do believe we can come to retest that low. What we also had just here, very directional move, pull back, very directional move, pull back. And I'm looking at the market still coming lower to retest the lows and actually break that level. However, the pattern we're entering will not break that level. But what we do have here is, just draw this out again, we had a uh, move lower, pull back, uh, move lower, pull back. And you can see here now, I'll actually draw out the pattern here, but I'll draw it out again on the 15 minute. So very directional movement and uh, we have the four touches, one, two, three, four. I'm going to do this on the 15 as well. Uh, you guys know that uh, when I see more than one of these patterns together, it's an indication that we're trending heavily or moving very directionally. And we had a move lower. And then just here, we had a triangle. One, two, three, four. We broke out the triangle and put in a low and tight flag. So this is a valid opportunity for me. Uh, let's just reposition that. Looking for that 127 fib. I am gonna go back to the 60 just so that we can see this clearer. Bring back on the orders. Stops have gone uh, six pips above the high here and then front running by two pips before those targets. So we have 30 pips of reward for a risk of 24. And we're back for the update and uh, we've rallied down now to hit targets for 31 pips. Uh, what a lovely looking trade, shame I didn't get a better entry there, but it worked out beautifully for 31 pips.